And here we are with another guest uh, of the tournament, Alexander Onishuk, Ukrainian-American grandmaster. You were in different times, Ukrainian champion, American champion, played for both countries, for the national teams. Uh, Alexander, welcome to the Grand Chess Tour. How is it to be here? Thank you, thank you, Anastasia. Um, no, it's great to be here. Thank you for inviting me. It's great to see this event like in person. It's been a while I've been to such big tournaments on this one, and uh, especially um, like uh, not in the U.S. because in the U.S. obviously I uh, attend some tournaments in St. Louis, but this one is um, you know just an amazing tournament uh, with lots of uh, great players. Uh, it's nice to follow the tournament and uh, many interesting games, many decisive games, and uh, yeah, I'm, I'm glad to be here. Who was the most impressive player so far, I mean, for you? Which games did you follow with, with, with interest? Well, I mean, you know, I should say all of them, obviously, but um, um, of course I'm rooting for uh, American players and uh, I'm glad to see that uh, Wesley So is leading uh, the tournament with uh, Leo Faronian. Um, yeah, I hope one of the U.S. players will, will win uh, this event. You, you were the one who took part also in this fundraising event for Ukraine. What were your impressions? What, what do you think about such events? Yeah. Well, I, th I think it was a great event and uh, many thanks to uh, the main sponsors, Superbet, and uh, obviously everyone who attended the event. Uh, it was great uh, to uh, meet all these people. I have talked to some of them next day and uh, they were telling us stories like uh, their personal stories, uh, how they support Ukraine, Ukrainian people. And quite frankly, you know, being here in Romania and meeting uh, uh, so many people that, uh, you know, do their best uh, uh, helping refugees, um, helping Ukraine, Ukrainians, uh, it's, it's very important for me to kind of uh, meet these people and thank them. Alexander, how did your life uh, change in a way after the war started? Because of course we know that you keep Ukrainian, uh, you, you have Ukrainian relatives in Ukraine and friends. Yeah, uh, well it has changed a lot, I should say. Um, as you know, I'm originally from Crimea and uh, I still have some friends there. I used to have more friends in Crimea and uh, uh, overall, I should say. but. Uh, uh, yeah, my, my life has also changed a little bit. Um, of course, you know, I started being more involved uh, once the war uh, started and uh, helping, helping, helping Ukraine. Also, uh, taking part uh, part in some events uh, in my hometown. <coughs> uh, we have a small Ukrainian community, and uh, um, I mean Americans they, they support Ukraine so much and. Uh, you know, we Ukrainians living in the U.S., we are very grateful to everyone who, who you know, who puts a flag outside of their house or just donates the money. And uh, it has happened from day one, and uh, I think it's very important and very important for the U.S. and very important, of course, for Ukraine to have uh, such a support in, 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 in America. Thank you very much, Alexander, and welcome once again to Grand Chess Tour, and uh, we hope to see you once again here, as I know that you are going to Poland as well.